A brand new comedy for the whole family to enjoy is now in theaters. Jim Carrey and the cast of Sonic the Hedgehog 2 tell Joel Gargiulo all about this hilarious new film. Okay, quick version. Robotnik is back. I discovered the source of ultimate power. We need to get it back or the world is doomed. You brought some kind of... <clears throat> Space porcupine. I am an echidna warrior. Hmm. I think the best feeling is watching a movie like this in a theater with kids, and there were kids at the screening that I got to go to. For me, like, that's infectious, and I'm just curious for you. Like, when was that moment when you became, like, addicted to that laughter? Well, the, to me, that's the whole point of this entire venture, is for not only me, to, you know, play the contrast to that beautiful innocence that Sonic, you know, uh, engenders and, and uh, that kind of preteen discovery of the world and non-skeptical, like, enjoyment of the zeitgeist and everything that happens. It's, it's all just play. It's all just things to play with. And then when kids and families share the movie in a theater or at home, you know, they feel that. They're reminded of that again. And they, that's what we love to watch movies yeah. with our kids because we're reminded of ourselves when before all the heaviness, you know, before yeah. we were being buried alive, man, you know what I mean? Can you just tell me about the joy that does come along with making a movie like this? I mean, the people, I mean, I, I was obsessed with Tika before I was, you know, did the first film, but to be able to work with her and, and to, with everyone else as well, I felt like we created this like off-screen family and I felt like that joy translated. Your laugh as every character is so different. Like, how do you come up with these laughs? They just, they kind of happen naturally out of the character, you know? If there's deep evil, it's <laughs> it's down here somewhere. And if it's sneaky -osity, it's a hee-hee-hee, -he, you know, it, but there's different uh, different tones. It's a musical scale. You know, Ben, I did come here today to ask you the hard-hitting questions, so I need to know, um, what was it like getting in shape for this role? Did you do your own stunts? Yes, thank you very much for this. I appreciate it. It was about three years. The second the first one ended, I said, well, I got to stay in shape. So I've only been eating nuts and berries. Uh, I've been acting like a hedgehog since day one. Uh, I am just hitting the gym like crazy. A lot of people don't know, but as a voice actor, thank you. Jim can speak to this thank too. You, but thank you. You have to be able to put on 40 pounds or lose 40 pounds in, an instant, in a week. In an instant. In an and instant. a lot of people think that, well, why would a voice actor, uh, actor have to do that? How dare you? How dare right. you? Channeling Robotnik, can you tell everybody why they need to see this movie? There's only one reason, and I'm bad.